morning guys, it's 9 o'clock on Monday morning. Pete's out there shoveling away. I would say about another 8 inches. It's quite chilly. The skies are quite... Well, they were grey, now they're coming into this pretty blue. So the sun's going to come out and melt everything that's left on the driveway. I cancelled my nail appointment, obviously, because at that point my car is at the bottom of the drive. I wasn't about to ask Pete to drive me in Ashley's car because Pete sits down here too. These need to be dug out. So I'm going to take a shower and go see if he needs help. Because right now he says don't come out. I think he'd rather get it done. Our neighbours were very kind though. They'd gone across our walkway in the front of the house with their snow blower this morning. So that was very nice. All right, yes, there we are. A snowy Monday. Um, I've got to run over to nails now, it's 25 to 12. The girl called me about an hour ago and said, where are you? I said, I called you this morning at 8.30 and said I wasn't coming because of the weather. Pete was digging out in the driveway. She said, oh, I didn't get it. So anyway, I'm going over for 12. And then Pete was just about to get in the shower. I took the dogs out and Roxy was taking a sweet time and I kept skidding on the same piece of ice. But it was stupid because I was in my slippers. Um, so Pete's phone started ringing, so I went and answered Pete's phone, and it was actually the job where he does coverage for. They called to see if he could come in and work, so he just left a few minutes ago. Um, so hopefully he'll have a couple of days there, which is good news, because we had nothing scheduled for this week. <sighs> Things have got to start falling into place now. Okay, I've got to run over to the bank because I don't have a dollar on me, and that's not good to go to have your nails done with no money. So I will talk to you all soon. I hope you're all having a wonderful Monday. Wherever you're, you are, I hope it's off to a good start. The sun is out now, so it will start to melt anything left in the driveway, which is nice. Anyway, gosh, this all needs cleaning. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bins are hidden. Turn my car around. Oh, <laughs> just made it, didn't I? Sure. Yep. Everybody, I hope you are doing well. It is 20 to 8 and there has been literally nothing to blog about today. I did go to Nails and I got back here and um, Ash and I were chit-chatting. I had one of those sausage, egg and cheese things for lunch and then Katie came and I swear to God while Katie was here every single phone in the house kept ringing <laughs> my cell phone, the home phone and the business phone. So I did end up having to pick up a couple of calls because I knew that the people would just keep calling back and um, then Katie left. I made a cup of tea, I came upstairs and Pete came home so we were just chatting about his day. Um, he's back there again tomorrow, which is great. Um, Roxy's just taken my spot on the bed to curl up. They've just had their dinner. Louis's taken my blanket. I use this blanket at night too, because I kind of sit up when I sleep, um, because of my back. The other day, somehow I ended up on my stomach and then that sets my back off. I've been having terrible spasms today. So I know tonight's going to be a bit of a, I need to go get my hot water bottle actually. But, um... Yeah, I just figured I would just take it easy for most of today. And when Katie left, I came up here and I was just filling some dates and stuff in on the planner, which was a lot of fun. I got some of my new stickers in the mail today that I ordered off the Etsy store. The Keep Calm and Carry On ones, of course. And things like that, little coffee cups with heart steam and little cameras. Ash doesn't have to go into work till later on in the day tomorrow. She said she'd drive me up there in the morning. So I will be out and about videoing something tomorrow. I feel like not calling and going up there, but it'd be a wasted trip. It's too bad. His office used to be right down the street, and now it's like... It's only like 15, 20 minutes away, but it's a pain. Do you know what I mean? Ash is on a, at a training right now at Sephora. She just texted because her other job called her. But that's all sorted. And then the banker called. Couldn't get him off the phone today. Um, he's already heard back about Ash's card. It'll be here this week at some point or in a week. But I couldn't get him off the phone. I had Katie here and I'm like, 
please stop talking. <laughs> I need to go. It just seemed like every call that called today wasn't just a one, two, three call. It was like a, it felt like a 15 minute call, which it wasn't, but there's been a lot of talking today. But I'm going, I can smell the shepherd's pie. It smells delicious. That's what's for dinner tonight. Ash will probably be home around nine-ish, or I think she's on the schedule till nine. Uh, hopefully she's learning some good things. I used some of my Sephora points and they don't have it at the store so I ordered it online because I want to try it. It's only a sample. It's a decent sample. This Paco Rabanne 1 million. I've been dying to smell it and haven't seen it in any of the stores except stores where the ladies are trying to sell you everything and anything which I didn't want to buy. So I used a hundred of my points on Sephora.com and I got this little bottle. How cute is that? You pull this whole gold thing off but I used to buy my dad Paco Rabanne and this is the ladies version and it's the uh, perfume and I've been dying to try it like I said and it's it's so good. So that is lovely. And then I got a Marc Jacobs highlighter but it's actually a, like a dark colour so I'm going to give that to Ash. That was by using points as well. I love earning points at Sephora and you get free things so you get to see how these things work and what they're like. So, yeah, that's nice. My Avon came too. That's another thing, Avon changed. I used to order Avon on a Wednesday and I would get it on a Friday by private messenger. But now they've stopped that and it comes via UPS and I hate it because they throw it on the step and your books and everything are in one box and it's not good. My question of the day is, what is one product you can't live without? All right, guys, I'm going to love and leave you for now. I hope everybody had a fantastic Monday, whatever you guys did today. I hope it was a good one, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, guys. Smudges on here. Sorry, guys, I've got to get that off. Can you tell now? Ah, oh, don't I look a right mess this morning? All because I'm trying to keep track. I don't know what I'm going to end up with now. Question of the day is... be question of the day question of the day do -do 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 question of the day i think i'd add it all i had a, oh wait no it's on the other computer that watching real housewives of cheshire ears are ringing as well ears are really ringing okay my favorite deodorant shampoo can what is one what is